Have you ever stopped to think what your car is actually made of? You know, for about a century, the answer was pretty simple, steel. But right now, there's a quiet revolution happening under the hood, inside the doors, everywhere. It's a high-stakes war on weight. And believe me, the future of driving really depends on who wins. So let's dive in. So, this is really the big question, isn't it? For most of car history, our vehicles just kept packing on the pounds. Every new feature, every new safety rule just added more weight. But now, all of a sudden, every single car maker is absolutely obsessed with putting their cars on a diet. So, what changed? Well, here's the heart of the problem. For decades, every time engineers wanted to add a new safety feature, you know, like airbags or a stronger frame, or even just some nice creature comforts, the car got heavier. And as you can see, all that extra weight was just a constant drag on fuel economy. Automakers were kind of stuck. Making cars better was also weirdly making them less efficient. To fight back against that, engineers now live by this really simple but powerful rule of thumb. It goes like this. For every 10% you can slash from a car's total weight, you get about a 6% boost in fuel economy. It's this direct, predictable trade-off that's pretty much become the holy grail for car designers everywhere. And that brings us right here to the modern war on weight. This is a battle being fought on two major fronts. First, against ever stricter government fuel economy standards, and second, against the totally unique demands of the electric vehicle revolution. Right, 